Right, okay guys, welcome to another kind of sort of compilation of some uh, new Spectrum games. I'm saying new, they're not all made this year, um, I think a few of them are, but uh, they're certainly recent games, games that have been made in the last sort of two, three years. Um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> the <clears throat> the 8-bit machines may have uh, sort of stopped becoming a thing commercially, I don't know, how many years ago, 20, 25 years ago? But uh, right now, you know, there is such a vibrant, vibrant uh, hobby around these machines. The Commodore 64, the Spectrum, the Amstrad, um, Atari. You know, people are still making games. They're pushing boundaries. I mean, they've, got, they've sort of got better documentation for the hardware. And so they're able now to produce games that we just quite simply would have never imagined was possible back in the day. So anyway, this one is called All Ha was it Hallows? All Hallows. Rise of the Pumpkin, a game by John Blythe, released in 2018. Um, <clears throat> right, let's see if we can go for keyboard. Hopefully this will work. <laughs> Very good. Alright, okay, so it's just left and right. There is no fire button as such. Ah, bollocks. Joystick, so you don't hear it. The noise. I'm gonna press fire button. The fire button doesn't see me. Get off! Ah, damn it! So yeah, it's basically left and right. I like the animation for the actual pumpkin itself. That's pretty, pretty cool. It does remind me a wee bit like Cauldron, uh, Cauldron Two. <coughs> which was released by Palace Software many, many moons ago. Can we go down now? We can't see me go down. Ah, don't jump into that. That's not good. I'm assuming we need to get some kind of key. I like the colour. I've got to see the colour is excellent. The Dark Lord has risen. Or Lord, sorry, has risen. All will follow him or be destroyed. Welcome, slaves, to your new master. All is lost. Press any key apart from the joystick. Let's go for one more we go, I think. Um, number two for Kempston. Now, I think this uses that fancy engine thing, whatever it's called. It's basically it's an engine, a software engine that allows the spectrum to display more colours than was previously thought possible. Now, can I get up there? I certainly can. Ah, ah bollocks. Nice graphics. Excellent colour as well. Can we get over there? Huh. I certainly can. <laughs> right, anyway, that is, what is it called, All Hallows. Let's take a look at something else. Right, this next one is called Baby Monkey Alba. Now, I may have actually already looked at some of these games. I can't remember, you know what, I'm not going to go back and check. Um, I don't remember seeing this one. The name is oddly familiar, but I might just be talking complete nonsense. So, let's go for Kempston. Baby Alba is very sad. Mom Monkey Marie has been kidnapped by someone and the baby monkey is alone. Help Alba find her mother. Be careful on the journey. Sorry, jungle solve a mystery. Blah, 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 blah. Have I played this? <laughs> Fantastic. I don't think I have played this. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of a Game & Watch game. Uh, it's very, very similar to, uh, is it Donkey Kong 2 or whatever it's called? I like this. It's simple. But it's good fun. There's not a lot in the way sound, I must admit, but... Yeah, it does. It reminds me of any game and watch game. It 
it's kind of got the look. Oh, balls! Did I just lose a life? I think I did. It's kind of got the look of a very, very early Spectrum game, you know, with the kind of the colour and that. But it's all about the playability. So I am looking to rescue my. Ah, damn it! Am I rescuing my mum? I can't remember. Right, got you. You've got to go up. Ah, where you go? I need to time this better. Get up. That's it. It's the same again. It's all about the playability, though. It really is. Um, can I jump on the vines? Nope. <laughs> game over. That's quite a nice little game. Very, very simple. Quite simplistic graphics, but the key is it's really, really... Uh, Really playable. So that is Baby Monka. Mon <laughs> Baby Monkey Alba. Put my teeth back in again. Right, next. Right, keeping on this sort of Donkey Kong theme. This is Donkey Kong Reloaded. This was released in 2013. Um, define keys. Hopefully it's going to use the joystick. Let's just batter on and see if it is. No, it doesn't. Right, so what I'm going to have to do is reload it. Hang on a second. Right, so to find keys, press key for right, left, down, up, jump. Oh, bloody hell. I'm never going to get this. Oh, wait, I wonder if I can go. Right, nah, it's not letting me do it right. Okay, right, left, down, up, jump, fire. This is going to be hopeless. G, N, and L. Ha, <laughs> bollocks. Ha, <laughs> <coughs> right, so I can fire, I think, can I? I assume I've got to go and pick up the, the money. It could do me some sound, I must admit. Ah, bollocks. Right, so you can kind of pass through the, the platforms. Can I jump up here? I can't, no I can't. Game over. Right, let's go again. Yeah, I am absolutely pants using keys. In fact, I've got to remove it to press. Ah. I know Spectrum owners were absolutely ha- Ah, come on, you twat. Spectrum owners were completely comfortable with keys. Because most of the games they played, unless they could afford a joystick, they used keys. In fact, a lot of people who've had the Spectrum probably actually preferred using keys. I mean, I think when you use keys, you can kind of get a more accurate game. Come on. Let's just try and get off the off this level. <laughs> ah bollocks. Right, come on, one more go. One more go. Yes. Nice graphics, nice animation as well. Right, so I've got to go up here. Oh, come on! Hey! Right, now we can put it off. <laughs> Look at the little tortoises. Or little Koopas, I suppose that's what they are, aren't they? Not quite as cute as... Ah, oh, bollocks. 
Oh, well, man, I need I can fire, can't I? How would I fire? I've got no idea. I am shite. I'm absolutely terrible using keys, I really am. Right, anyway, that's quite frustrating just because I am completely incompetent when it comes to using keys in a game. So that is Donkey Kong Reloaded. Let's take a look at another one. Right, this uh, oddball is called Gem Chaser. Keyboard redefine. Right, okay, let's go for... So, left, right, jump. What is that, L? Is that L for jump? I think it is. Zero to start? That is. Alright, okay. Playable. Alright, what the hell are we doing here? Alright, okay. Right, so the idea is to collect all the. Right, so you can jump, like so. Right, now, how do you get... Unlucky, right, so you can't... Why is that unlucky? What, why did I die there? This is what you call minimal graphics. Oh, now, wait a minute, so when I pass through the gate, I change colour. So does that mean that I can now... Why is it making that noise? Right, so I'm red, so presumably... Right, I'm not quite sure why I'm kind of dying there. Right, so we want to go red and then we want to collect them like so, I think. Right, and if I... Uh, I don't know if I can go up here. Right, let's go for one more go. I've no idea why can I not... How can I get back up the top when it seems to kind of kill me? Can I go in the middle? Ah! Why did I manage to go up there? No problem. Right, not quite sure what's going on there. But that looks like a ni nice kind of little fun... Uh, Puzzle game, if you can actually figure out what you're supposed to do, that is Gem Chaser. Right, I think time for one more. Right, this last one is called Gravibots. Keyboard Sinclair Kempston, right, so space to move, let's go for Kempston. Okay, right, enter to select. Enter password. I don't want to enter a password. Come on, we just want to play the bloody game. Right, any key to start. Right, so I am... down here. Right, okay, so I can jump and walk along the roof, or if I pull down... Right, so it's kind of like opposite gravity. Now, have I got to try and collect these wee guys? Avoid them? Avoid them, obviously. Right, how do we do this? So what am I trying to collect, I wonder? I'm not overly sure what I'm trying to do here. Pressing space doesn't seem to do anything. Or pressing fire, I should say. So I need to avoid these wee guys. I'm not <coughs> really sure what I'm trying to do.
Tell you what, I wonder if I'm going to I'm going to restart it using the keys just in case there's a there's possibly a button I'm missing like keyboard. Of course, I now don't know what. The <laughs> right, it doesn't actually tell you what keys it is. Right, listen. Um, let's look at one more since I was rubbish at that one. That is Gravy Bots. We'll take a look at one last one. Right, this last one is called Manic Mix Up. The 2018 Manic Minor Remix. Press one of the following keys to set the game's running speed. I think we'll go for slow. Right, I'm looking forward to this actually. <laughs> I'm just trying, is this Kenny? Ah, right, okay, you know what? This is actually the game kind in reverse. That's exactly what it is. That's bizarre. It just feels totally wrong. Yeah, so basically it's the game in reverse. Right, I should have probably... I should have probably went for the, the faster game, but I'm going to restart it. Let's restart it, but we'll go for fast, I think. Right, I wouldn't say that's fast, I would just say that that is normal speed. This is weird. <laughs> it just feels completely wrong. Right, I've made an arse of that. Right, it's not technically all in the verse, because I mean that wee guy at the bottom is not normally there. So no, I'm wrong in saying it's all in the verse, it's just kinda... Some of it's... Like that top level is basically back to front. <laughs> Let's see if we can complete at least one screen. Right, okay, that's it. Might we get the idea of game over? Come on, let's start again. Ah! Alright, jumping. Ah, it's bizarre, so there's a kind of hidden key. Right, I think I need to get that one last of all then. I'm not quite so keen in the music. Matthew Smith's version is definitely better. Ah, balls. Right, come on, let's go for one last shot, I think. Any time. See, that's, it's things like that that annoy me about games. There's no reason to have that big delay. Right, last go. Let's go. a lot, lot tougher than the original. Right, I need to jump right across this side here. Now, what I need to do is start running. Like so. Oh, you twat. Right, you know what, I've had enough. That's a uh, manic mix-up. So anyway guys, there's five, I think, games. Um, sorry I've not got any links to them. I was actually given these games with one of my friends, but just Google it. 
and you'll find them. I will put the name of the games in the description below and you should easily find them. So anyway guys, as always, thank you very, very much for watching.